Hi everyone, welcome to the channel. In this video, I want to introduce one of the best image editing model called Quen Image Edit. This is built on the 20 billion parameter Quen Image model. It brings precise text editing for both Chinese and English. They also have published a blog on it. There is GitHub for the inference code. There is also API available. So let's take a look at the uh, blog. They published a detailed description for about what the model is and uh, some of the introduction for the basic uh, features. We can delete things, remove the hair, stream of hair. We can input a letter, we change the letter M to blue from, from the brown to blue. Wow, that's really accurate here. Um, there is uh, change the background, replace the background to different uh, things, to beach, to a uh, classroom. There is a virtual try-on. I think this is also very exciting. I think virtual try-on is one of the very uh, interesting feature that many people like, right? So I think this uh, give you a precise control on the virtual control part. There is uh, the text editing, so we can uh, just describe what we want to make the edit to. I think this is powerful. You can to add letters. You can replace the entire letters to uh, Chinese characters. Um, there are text editing also. Change the phrase, take a breath on the note to the relax and the recharge. And while preserving the environment entirely, and uh, also here we can see that there is uh, some artifact on the original image, but uh, by instructor it to change the tur space m to turm, while it can understand uh, the meaning of the space here. There is uh, post editing. I think uh, you can um, provide a detailed uh, instruction to how the post uh, should be edited. So I think that's really nice. There are many, many more examples. I really recommend that everyone to get a read about it. Next, I want to introduce one of the plays to try the new model for free. This is in the try it now link, the chat.quen.ai. Okay, all right. So once we are um, typing the chat.quen.ai, we can see that there is a task list. First of it is the image edit. Find it and click on it. So now I think there's some example. So we will provide some uh, local input image to ask it to make edit. So previously I made uh, several input image. So I will try them. For the, this image, I want to edit the text, change the sign, the text to text color to yellow on the sign and press the send button. So now we want to change the color of the text from black to yellow. So we Let's see how it works. Okay, we see that we successfully received uh, the output image, and I think uh, it looks wonderful. We can download it. And let's compare it with our original image. Well, as we can see, the other part of the image looks uh, almost uh, exactly the same. And I, I think we can try other things. How about uh, if we want to remove all the persons from this photo? So we, we don't want any people in here. We just want a clear, clean stair here. So let's uh, try it. Remove all the persons on that uh, red stair. 
and press the send button. All right, we received our results. Let's compare it uh, uh, to our input image. So let's download it first. So now let's uh, compare the input with the output. So the input is on the left and the output is on the right. All right, I think it uh, really did a wonderful job. All the persons on the stair have been gone and all the environment has been preserved. Overall, I think this is a really nice image editing model, one of the state-of-art model, and the best of all is that it's open source. Sooner or later, I think everyone will be able to run it locally. Please stay tuned. I will share how to run it locally and the speed of running it locally in future videos. Thank you for watching. Please give it a thumb up and share it. Please subscribe to the channel for future content. Thank you for your support. Goodbye.